I can't, <laughs> can't quite see. There we go. So this is the autonomic nervous system, uh, what to look for. So it goes all the way from the yellow to the red. And I'm going to talk to you what the yellow to red is. So the yellow is where you are too relaxed. So it's not a healthy place to be. Um, and it's called parasympathetic. Um, and it's where you're feeling too low. You're feeling it's saying here your re respiration is shallow. Your heart rate is slow. Your blood pressure is likely to be low. Um, your humidity to so your mouth and skin is dry. Um, you may be warm or cool, but you may be feeling grief, sadness, shame or disgust. Um, and you're feeling very withdrawn. How many of us have children who present like that? And they appear to be demand avoidant, won't come out of their room, won't engage in life. They're in that zone. We need to get them out into more active zones. But how do we do that? I'm going to talk to you very briefly. I'm no expert on this. I've just got a huge amount of interest in this and I study it daily. Um, then moving through into the, the sort of healthier areas, so you've got calm. Um, so that's the ventral vagus, uh, uh, the parasympathetic number two um, in the ventral vagus. And this is normal life. This is where you are safe. You think safely. You're clear thinking. Your social engagement is healthy. You're alert and ready to act. So these are really good areas to be in. This is where because we don't need to be too relaxed. Um, and then, of course, we've probably all heard of flight or fight. Um, so you go through these stages into flight or fight which is where you react to danger. Um, you can have fast uh, breathing. You um, have elevated blood pressure. Um, you're feeling cool and cold and you've got, you may have cold sweats. Um, you have rage and fear. How many of our children enter these stages quite often during the day and get punished for it? They can't help it. It's their autonomic nervous system. This is science. This is not something I'm making up. Um, and then we go all the way into the real red zones where you've got hyperfreeze and hypofreeze. Um, and hypofreeze is really where you do shut down. So we, we've shared things just recently on, on um, shutdown and how your body does shut down. Um, but it's where basically your muscles become quite flaccid. Um, you've got hyperventilation. Um, you've got very, very slow uh, heart rate because initially effectively your autonomic nervous system is basically saying i'm preparing to end end everything which is why children go into this sort of state of freeze it's a real freeze it, it basically says on here your primary state um is preparing for death so i want to show you so there's the the yellow all the way through to the red at the end you can get this on our